This is Maya. And she's on the hunt. But she's not hunting an animal. She's hunting its poo. Where is it? Where is it? Maya's job is to help us humans do a better job finding koala poo. Yep, Maya is a koala poo hunter. Disgusting. So how come Maya's trained to find koala droppings? Well, it's to help her handlers find the koalas that drop them there. Because koalas aren't always that easy to find, hiding all the way up in their trees. The great thing with dogs is they can smell what we can't see. Um, koala poo smells very much of eucalyptus, and so they can help us locate scats very easily. Where is it? Where is it? Can you see? She just pointed at it with her nose, and then she dropped. You're such a good girl, Maya. And a smart nose like this one can even track down koalas that have moved around a bit. And the poo stay in the environment for many months, sometimes years which means that if you arrive in a site and there's no koala, you might find their evidence on the ground. And that tells you that's koala habitat. In many parts of Australia, koala numbers are declining because of dog attacks, road strikes and vanishing habitat. So researchers like these guys are trying to figure out which are the most important areas to keep protected. You can see how small they are and they're so easily obscured in the litter. So for a human to see that, it's really hard. Maya, Maya! Although a canine researcher might sound like a strange idea, dogs like Maya are really suited to the job. You need a lot of stamina because you have to cover a lot of ground and look under each tree for scats. For Maya, that's not a problem. She, she is playing and she has high stamina, so she's 20 times faster at finding the scats. But most importantly for conservation, she's 150% more accurate. So that means that she's finding scats where humans are not. And for habitat protection, this is critical. But even the best poo detectors need to keep their skills up. With a bit of training. So it's very simple, because we don't want to take her in the bush and for her to start indicating on possum pool or eastern grey pool. We want to make sure that Maya knows so what koala, koala poo is and exclude any other master poo poo. And what does Maya get out of it? Well, first up, she was actually rescued and given a home when she got the job. It was um, a win-win for her. She got a second family and for us, we pretty much got the best detection dog we could wish for. And on top of that, for this pup, tracking and playing fetch rarely feels like work. If you think about it, dog don't go to work for a salary. They go to work because for them it's play. You're such a good girl, Maya. 